China is home to one of the world's most charismatic and iconic mammals, the giant panda. Unfortunately, it is also endangered. Scientists from all over the globe are trying to save the giant panda from extinction, but they can't do it alone. There is a way you can help save the giant panda, and it starts with understanding climate change. Right now, many factors are contributing to climate change, especially human activities like burning fossil fuels. These factors are increasing the amount of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere, which is slowly increasing the temperature of our planet. The changes in temperature affect behaviors of plants and animals, and species have been observed migrating to higher elevations to escape warmer temperatures. This phenomenon is known as upward shift. So how does climate change affect giant pandas? One word, bamboo. Giant pandas constantly feed on enormous amounts of bamboo per day. It makes up over 99% of their diet. If all of their bamboo disappears, your favorite furry friends will starve. And this is a viable concern. Remember upward shift? Well, the chemicals in bamboo plants are sensitive to warming temperatures, so they are showing signs of movement upwards and elevation. This effect has two main negative consequences for the panda. One, bamboo plants have an unusual extended reproduction interval that may prevent them from adjusting their spatial distribution over multiple generations. If they cannot adjust their location to avoid warming temperatures, there will be massive bamboo die-offs resulting in panda starvation. Two, if the bamboo plant is able to shift upwards, it could potentially move completely out of the panda reserves. Currently, the preferred elevation range of giant pandas falls 200 meters short of the optimal range for bamboo growth. If the bamboo shifts too far up in elevation, the borders of the reserves may prevent the giant panda from reaching bamboo and force them to retreat to starvation. So what can be done to help? An important factor is the lack of space in and connectivity between reserves. If China could mitigate these limitations, the pandas would be able to maintain contact with their food stores. Another important factor is documenting the exact species of bamboo in each reserve to predict harmful behavior to the giant panda. Current mapping technology can potentially predict die-offs or upward shifting. So what can you do to help? You can help combat climate change. Turning off lights to conserve electricity, walking or biking instead of driving, and eating locally grown foods are great ways of cutting down your dependency on fossil fuels. If you can do a few of these things every day, you will help save the giant pandas from extinction.